Hello everyone, this is Rachel or Calanthiel Tan and welcome to another unboxing type video. Today we're going to be looking at some prints by Five Hens Studios on Etsy. Five Hens Studios is a shop that I've had an eye on for quite a while. They take photos of American Girl dolls, really artistic photos of them, and then there are all these different products available on the Etsy site with those photos on them. So I picked out my three favorites. Shipping was a little slow, but they did say on their Etsy page that it would be slow, so I expected that, and I'm really excited to get a closer look at them. This is a little note from the owner of the shop. Thank you, love Sydney. I ordered it right before Christmas, I believe. I'm opening this rather late due to various circumstances. I have been having trouble finding good time slots in which to film, but we're, we're at it today and I'm really happy to get a look at them. So these are the ones I picked and technically they are postcards which I really like postcards. I use them just like prints because I have like a little gallery door on the back of the door and this kind of thing is perfect for it. They are a little bit small postcards, but they are really cute. This one is called The Study of Freedom and it's a photo of Addie. I don't think this is her classic dress, but I do recognize the necklace. I believe that's the classic Addie necklace. She looks like an American Girl Addie, not a Pleasant Company Addie, but I could be mistaken about that. And I recognize the quilt in the background from Addie's classic bed set, and that looks like the doll that you used to be able to get for her. But it could be a similar doll because it's not in focus. This print's called Part of Your World. And this one is a custom American Girl doll. It almost looks like maybe it has the Nania, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, head sculpt. I'm fairly new to American Girl dolls, so please, if I'm saying anything wrong, please feel free to correct me in the comments. I'm always excited to learn more about them because there is so much to know about them. It looks like this was actually taken on a real beach and probably a handmade custom outfit would be my guess. It's really cute. Oh, and before I forget, the artist is also known as Five Hens and a Cockatiel. So it just depends on which platform you're on and where on the page you are, if, whether it's Five Hens Studios or Five Hens and a Cockatiel. And then finally, we have Through the Woods. And this one is of, of course, Kaya in her full meat outfit in the woods. And it looks really nice. I love the blurred foliage in the front. I'm pretty sure this is the picture that made me decide to finally place an order with them. I just really love these postcards. I remember the prices being very reasonable. I'll put it up on the screen so you guys can see, but it was a really, really good price. And you know, they got here safely and everything. And the little note that came with them was a really nice touch. So I'm really happy with it. And if I ever need more prints, I will be sure to place another order from the shop. This video is not sponsored, but I just really wanted to buy something from the shop and review it here. I've always thought the whole concept of their shop was so cool. And I will also put in text up here some of the other products that they carry in their shop just in case postcards aren't your jam. Thank you so much for watching. If this is your first video by me, I typically make videos about ball jointed dolls, miniatures, and art dolls with occasional content about fashion dolls and vintage dolls. I release three videos a week. If any of that sounds cool to you, be sure to check out some of my other videos and subscribe. If you're already familiar with my content, don't forget about the Facebook group where I try to post every time I release a video here on YouTube so that you guys don't miss notifications. And so you all can give feedback on the videos I have to mark for legal reasons as made for kids. I also have the Patreon where you can support the channel for as little as two dollars a month in exchange for getting early access to all of my videos one to two weeks early. And now that I've reached my first support goal, I also give away one doll to a patron every single month. And Patreon is the only place where I ever give away dolls. So be sure to check that out if that sounds cool to you. Those who support me on the Fairy Godparent tier on Patreon, in addition to what I already mentioned, also get a sticker sent to them every single month of one of my dolls and a shout out in every single YouTube video I make. So shout out to Road Eric Fan, Tanner Girl, and my anonymous Fairy Godparents. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.